makes the town the Braves are the team baseball's my summertime every chance I get I'm at the stadium where there's always something happening so look out Dodgers and step back Reds our Atlanta Braves have only begun there's action all of the time but most important you'll find the name of the game is fun We have a note here that that song debuted as the Quixie and Dixie pick hit of the week back in 1966. And we're bringing it back. <laughs> <laughs> well, we've got a pitching change and a big moment here. First, our game summary, Philadelphia. Seven runs on seven hits. Braves three runs on 11 hits. And coming on to pitch, making his major league debut is Pete Moylan, our Hennessy game summary. Now Moylan in, our Sherwin-Williams pitching change. Pete Moylan is the 27-year-old Aussie that the Braves signed in February. And his first big league hitter is Ryan Howard. This is an incredible story. Moylan spent two years in the Twins organization in rookie ball out of high school. Here's Howard sending one of the air to center field and Andrew Jones. But things didn't work out for Moylan, so he went back to his native land, suffered through two back operations, was in pharmaceutical sales, started to pitch again in the weekend league, but after his second back operation, he found that he couldn't come up over the top anymore, so he had to drop down three-quarter and sidearm it. And all of a sudden, he discovered, hey, wait a minute. I'm hitting the radar gun at about 95, 96. <laughs> he tries out and makes the World Baseball Classic team for Australia. Pitches against Venezuela. Struck out, among others, the Phillies' Bobby Abreu. And that got the attention of the Braves. They signed him to a contract. He pitched well in spring training and won. It was a split sp squad game. Bobby Cox was at the other game, but John Scherholz was at the game Moylan pitched. And although he didn't make the club last week coming out of spring training, he went down to Richmond, appeared in two games. And when Joey Devine was sent down, Moylan gets his shot in the big leagues. Boy, you just never know, do you? No, you don't know. And the Braves have been known at doing things like this, taking people from other organizations or even out of the minor leagues and put them in, putting them in a role where they could succeed. This guy throws from the side. He could be one of those trick pitchers to right-handers coming from that angle. It's very tough to pick up for a right-handed hitter, somebody that throws from the side, or almost sometimes his pitches are underneath, almost a submariner. And it scoots down the right field line. Fair ball into the corner. Now an odd kick away from Fran Coor. And David Bell is down at second base. It, Off the end of the bat, cue shot. You know, it's interesting. It was a good pitch, but David Bell was fighting to stay in on the ball because he knows a guy coming from the side like that, the temptation is to pull off it. So he fought himself in, and he hit it off the end of the bat inside first base. Got himself a double. Mike Lieberthal. Doubled in two in the second. Since then he's lined to center and lined to third. Squeezes out number two. It was interesting. He just threw two sidearm breaking balls to Lieberthal and put him right on the money. David DeLucci coming up to pitch hit. DeLucci's got power. One for nine so far this season. 
His career has taken a detour to Philadelphia. How many guys hit 29 home runs one year and are on the bench with another team the next year? 29 home runs with Texas last year, 65 RBIs. Prior to that, he had been an outstanding pinch hitter for Arizona, if you remember, and really hit a fastball. One ball, and two strikes. talking earlier about the variety of speeds his fastball was at 93 then he threw a changeup and then he threw a kind of a frisbee breaking ball all different speeds there's the frisbee at 75 but you coach Roger McDowell watching Peter Moylan make his big league debut Got him. A strikeout of DeLucci. The maiden voyage successful for the Australian Peter Moylan. 7-3 Phillies to the bottom of the eighth. 